The Blue Eyes White Dragon has always been considered the Charizard or the Black Lotus of Yu-Gi-Oh. However, which version of the iconic Blue Eyes is the Grail of Yu-Gi-Oh? This topic is still debated amongst collectors, but of the big three Blue Eyes, only one is pulled from packs. The randomization of booster packs makes the Legend of Blue Eyes version by far the rarest version of the iconic monster. Dark Duel Stories and Starter Deck Kaiba, while both being the preferred anime artwork, guaranteed the card in their respective products, which has hurt their claim to Graildom. But exactly how hard is it to pull the first edition Blue Eyes White Dragon? Throughout the last 20 years, boxes have been opened and Blue Eyes has been pulled, but not many have been recorded. By the time recording openings on YouTube had become popular, first edition Legend of Blue Eyes boxes had gotten very expensive, deterring most people from buying and opening their boxes. I searched through the archives of Yu-Gi-Oh! YouTube opening history, and this is what I was able to find. There have been 15 first edition Legend of Blue Eyes boxes opened on YouTube, as well as one fake opened by Simply Unlucky. Simply Unlucky has opened three of these boxes. As we mentioned before, one was fake. One, the camera actually broke in the middle of the opening, but there's no reason to believe that he lied about the polls. And then there was one that was recorded fully. Old School Expert has also opened three boxes. His were all legit and all recorded. I have opened two boxes. Petty Party has opened a box. Eagle Fan 159 aka Sassiato, Vintage Yu-Gi-Oh, Yu-Gi-Oh Old School, F-Man Gaming, 416 Rare Cards, YG O'Brien, and The Forbidden One 2002. A couple of these videos were not all in one video, such as when I opened my Trihorn Dragon and then later opened the rest of the box. Yu-Gi-Oh! Old School also did his in two different videos, and The Forbidden One 2002 had no wrapping on his box when he opened it. But overall, that gives us 15 legit boxes. Legend of Blue Eyes has 10 total ultras in the set, two per box, which gives you a 20% chance to pull the Blue Eyes White Dragon. Now that we know how many boxes were opened, how many Blue Eyes were pulled? Since we know that there were 30 total Ultras, there should be three Blue Eyes White Dragons according to the ratio. Only one was pulled. All right, here we go. This is the last pack. I'm really hoping to get another Ultra Rare, but as I already said, these old packs, they usually don't contain a lot of Holos. And I mean, we got an Exodia, so it doesn't even matter. Kurama, Terra the Terrible, Dark Grey, a Turtle Tiger, and holy oh my, this is, what is, what is wrong with this box? A Blue Eyes White Dragon in the last pack, after pulling Exodia and Raigeki. <laughs> However, this was not the only Blue Eyes White Dragon pull ever recorded. There was one other that occurred in the most bizarre of circumstances. This Blue Eyes was pulled from a free extra error pack, and if you think about the ratios of one pulled from 15 boxes, that makes the circumstances even crazier. Uh, some of these sell for $15 to $20 on eBay. I've seen them go for that much. I was thinking about selling this one, but I thought, you know what, it's free, I'm going to open it. If anything is a hollow, this is what I would want. But if it's a rare, I would love a Fusionist. Because I don't have one. And it doesn't look like it's hollow, but that's alright. So Hitatsu Mi Giant. Laser Cannon Armor. Petite Angel. The Furious Sea King. And a Giant Soldier of Stone. It's not a fusionist. Oh well. Whoa, what the heck? Are you Whoa. kidding me? Whoa, that's... What? How is that possible? I just got a first edition Blue Eyes White Dragon. It's in perfect condition. This is... Holy... You've got to be kidding me. After hearing how few Blue Eyes have been pulled on camera compared to other big card games such as Pokemon and Magic, Magic had four Lotuses pulled. They were between Alpha, Beta, and Unlimited, but because those were never reprinted, they're very similar to first edition Legend of Blue Eyes. I don't know the exact number of Charizards pulled, but I know that there are more than two for sure. So was Blue Eyes White Dragon short printed? Or is this just a product of a small sample size? All we know for sure is that it's very difficult to pull and obtain. Let me know your opinions in the comments regarding the pull rate of the Blue Eyes White Dragon, the rarity, the value. It's a very interesting topic. That is it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed delving into the history of YouTube Yu-Gi-Oh! openings when it comes to first edition Legend of Blue Eyes White Dragon. If you did, make sure to like the video and subscribe for more epic content coming up. But before we end the video, I have to shout out my ultimate supporters on YouTube and Patreon. 
Shout out to TCG Trusty Cards, Toe and Fo Show, Tomato Jews, Stanley, Mike Nance, and Mimic Gecko. Thank you guys for supporting the channel, and that's it for this video. I will see you guys later. Peace.